episode number 21. This is much easier than I thought it was going to be. They just keep coming. I'm not even melting. I've had many of these. I've had many of these ideas before, but they just keep flooding back in. Oh, put this one out. Put this one out. Anyway, sorry. So today's app. Today's today. These have all been on the same day. Apple number 21 is a divorce app. So I've never gotten married and therefore never gotten divorced. But I do have a child and have friends with children. And the amount of conflict that comes from divorce, I feel there's a way we can all be more amicable. Where we can form small groups who are people who are going through it to be able to vent about our ex and find peaceful, loving solutions. Not just be a space to be like, and he's an asshole! But also be a space of like, hmm, have you thought about it from his side? And like, you, he only gets them every other weekend. That seems like that's not, you know, he doesn't seem to get 50% of the time. Maybe it's not fair. Maybe, anyway, having a space where you can discuss it. Having a space that helps communication between exes. Who has the kids when? Who's responsible for what? That recitals on this date. Whether the other person's coming. I mean, all the conflicts that are that go back and forth in text, just having one place to, to hold that. And I mean, I guess an, an, another idea, I'll wait for maybe the other idea on the next one. So divorce app. So helping with co-parenting of children, even pets if you want, who has custody, coordinating, if you share how, or I mean, where your houses are, the kids have a house, I mean, finding solutions that make it as easy as possible on the kids and don't leave the next generation scarred from divorce. That is idea number 21.